They get to the art print and the character sticker sheet. Happy Monday. Today is Patreon mail packing day. Um, so I'm going to be getting all of the rewards for March and packing it up and shipping it out. Um, depending on how things go, it's usually about a one to two day process. So we'll see um, if I make it through all of them today or if I have to push some of them to tomorrow. I do have a few more patrons than usual, so it might become a two day thing. Uh, but like I said, we'll see. So let's get to work. just finished up the fawn tier which is one of the lower tiers they get the art print and I like to put a little handwritten note in there um, and now moving on to the kitten tier um, so they get the art print and the character sticker sheet which is this right here um, so I'll be doing those next and then I'll be moving on to the fox tier which I will talk to you about that when I get there all right back to work <laughs> just finished the kitten tier reward so now moving on to the fox tier and so what they get um, in addition to the fawn tier and the kitten tier is they get the journaling sticker sheet so that's what this is um, it's all a bunch of the fairy garden themed motifs on journaling sticker paper um, and it coordinates really nicely with the character stickers they go together really well um, so they'll get this, and they'll get this, and this. Um, so yeah, moving on to the fox tier. just finished the fox tier level so this next tier is the biggest chunk it's um, tiger tier which that tier receives the most physical rewards plus tiger plus so that one receives all of the tiger tier rewards plus the digital artwork so all of the artwork all of everything you saw on the character sticker sheet 
and the journaling sticker sheet. They get all of that digitally to use to print their own stuff or to like do digital planning, something like that. Um, and then there's the Tiger Plus International, which is the same as Tiger Plus, but just um, for people outside of the United States. Um, and then after that, I only have one other uh, tier, which is Owl Plus, which is people that don't want the stickers and the art print. They just want the Tiger tier level reward, which is for this month, it's two a set of two washi tapes. Um, so that one I'll do at the very end and they just get the two washi tapes. Um, when I'm packing the Tiger tier level orders, I do it in two parts. So this first part I'm going to be, I'm headed, that's why the lighting is changing so dramatically. I'm heading to my storage closet where I keep all of my uh, products for the shop and I'm getting some um, shipping bags. So these, these, um, and I'm going to do, put all of these stickers and the art prints in these first and then I will get the washi tape out and add those to all of the packages. Uh, so that's just going to take me the longest chunk of time and I'm going to go ahead and get started on it. I'll probably have to take a break somewhere in there for lunch. But yeah, that's the next step in today's workload. <laughs> stickers and the art prints into the um, packaging, the bags, and now I think I'm going to go have some lunch because I'm starving and then I will start working on putting the washi tape sets in these. <music> because it is so windy here that it's making the windows squeal. It does this every once in a while. It drives me absolutely insane. I'm sure you can hear it a little bit in the background. It sucks. <laughs> but um, I'm moving on to, I've got all the, everything is packed. All of the Patreon mail is packed. Um, I've just got to wrap them up in my tissue paper and baker's twine and then print shipping labels. I don't think I'm gonna make it to finishing today. Um, it's really annoying. Um, I'm gonna see how far I can get before I have to pick my kids up from school, but today's been kind of a rough day for a couple of my kids and I think they're gonna need me this afternoon. So I think I'm gonna have to finish this tomorrow morning. So. Um, I'll film what I get done for the rest of today and I'll see you back tomorrow. <laughs> Thank you.
happy Tuesday. So, get your lighting. It's been a day. Um, I had a class this morning that I had to log into. It's like a Zoom type call. And um, I was trying to get the shipping labels printed for the Patreon packages that I needed to finish today. And they kept printing with like one or two letters or numbers missing from the address on the label, which was super frustrating. I couldn't figure out what was going on. Finally, I got some support on the line and they had me print from like a different um, browser. Something with the PDF file coming from Safari, it was getting borked. But anyways, I finally got it fixed. I only wasted about 50 sheets of shipping label paper, which just like hurts because uh, just the waste. I hate unnecessary waste. So that's like hurting my heart that I have like a 50 sheets of shipping label paper that I now just have to throw away. Um, but onwards, I'm gonna start working on packaging the orders and hopefully get that done quickly because I have other stuff I need to get done today. Like I wanted to post the color palette for this month's theme in Patreon. Um, and I had some artwork that I need to work on for Patreon that I need to get done. So. Let's get to work. shipping labels to print correctly. I got them all on the mailers. I got them all the packages in. I've got a big bag full of packages next to me here. I'm going to go drop those off in about an hour. I've got to pick my girls up from school so I'm going to run by the post office then and drop these off and they'll be in the mail. Um, I have about an hour of work time left that I can get some stuff done. So I'm going to work on creating a color palette image for um, Patreon so that I can share the color palette for the theme this month. Um, so it's kind of fun to show what the color scheme is going to be. And I also include a um, file, like a Procreate file. So if you use Procreate, you can import the color scheme directly into your Procreate to use for a project. Um, and I also include a PDF, like if you want to use it for some other purpose. But anyways, that's what I'm going to be doing next. <laughs> to work on creating a color palette poll for Patreon. Um, we're voting on the theme for July, which I'm pretty sure the theme, sorry, I'm pretty sure the theme, A Summer in France is what won for the July Patreon theme. Um, and now I'm going to let everyone vote on the color scheme. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to create a graphic with some different color scheme options and then get that put up on Patreon. And then I'm going to work on some illustrations, I think. See you in a minute. 
So here is the graphic that I made for the color palette options. Um, I just did four options and I'm going to post this on Patreon now and see what everyone thinks. Happy Thursday. Um, this is going to be the last day of the vlog. I'm going to try and edit this tonight so I can get it up for tomorrow. But um, today I first of all need to clean my desk. It is so bad right now. Um, I worked a lot on my illustrations for the next couple of months on Patreon so I can start designing the sticker sheets and the washi tape and get that sent off to my manufacturer so that's done on time and then I also uh, packed all of my shop orders on my website yesterday. So at this point I'm pretty much caught up on all of my admin stuff for the week. So um, I'm going to be working more on artsy stuff for the rest of the week after I get my desk clean. Um, there is a pin that I'm in the middle of designing for, it's a mermaid pin and I am going to create a graphic for that. Um, I created two colorways and I just can't decide which one to go with so I'm going to post it on my Patreon and see what people think. So it'll be interesting to see what the feedback is on that. But anyways, let's clean my desk. <laughs> side of them and I don't think I need to do a poll anymore. I think I know which one I want to go with. Let me show you. So here are the two mermaid colorways I came up with. I wanted to do a monotone mermaid so the one on the left is a peach colors monotone and the one on the right is a teal and turquoise colors monotone. Um, I did give her some peach cheeks just because that's what I do <laughs> and I don't know I think I like the green one better <laughs> just because it I feel like it fits the vibes like the color fit the vibes of a mermaid and the ocean better but also because it feels more universal like even though this one is in peach tones because it's peach it looks like she is a light-skinned mermaid um, and this one looks more like she could be any like she could apply you know more universally to different um, skin tones and I just I want to create this is for patreon so I want to create one that is more um, universally appealing to everybody um, if this pin does well I may go back and make it in the peach tone one as like a later down the road thing but I think as far as patreon goes I'm gonna go with the teal mermaid and she's really pretty and I think a lot of the other illustrations that I did for this collection are going to be more in this color range so it will match really well um, so now I need to go through and figure out what the Pantone colors are for this because right now I just have it in CMYK so I'm gonna have to get my Pantone color book out which it's fun to see all the colors but it's also really stressful to me to try and match the colors because I'm always worried I'm going to do it wrong. Anyways, that's what I'm going to work on next.
here's what I will be sending off to my pin manufacturer. I've got the design and then all of the Pantone colors, including the plating, and then they will take this on their end and make sure that all of this is going to work with the way that they have to create the pins. Um, and then they'll send me back a rendering of what the pin will look like and um, we'll go from there. Okay, I also submitted this design to my enamel pin manufacturers for this tiny bee. It's gonna be like this big. Probably the smallest pin I've ever done, um, but I think this is gonna be really cute in a tiny size. Um, I have a cute idea for a backing card for it, which I haven't completely fleshed out, so I'll be back when I have that part of the design done, but I just submitted this also, so I've got two pins going in. Um, there's also a third that I wanna do a remake of, but in a different color, so I'm waiting to hear back from them if that's possible, but yeah, pins incoming. Okay, so I also wanted to show you that um, I did these designs in my sketchbook using Copic markers. Let me get to the right page these and I think they turned out really cute and they're all kind of in the same color scheme um, so I think I'm going to use this for my summer um, shop update and do one or two sticker sheets using these illustrations um, so later today I'm gonna have to scan these in and clean them up in Photoshop which I'm still not 100% confident using there is a course um, that an illustrator that I follow does in the fall, so I'm looking forward to taking that. But for right now, I've just kind of got to wing it. <laughs> but uh, clean those up in Photoshop, and then I'll probably clean them up a little bit more um, on my iPad because it's easier to go with my pencil. But making some stickers out of these for the summer collection, that little B enamel pin is also going to be about part of that summer um, shop update, and I have one or two more ideas. Do, I do want to do a washi tape and um, possibly something new that I've never done before. We'll see how it goes. But anyways, that's going to be it for this studio vlog. Thanks for joining me throughout my work week. Um, yeah, I'm going to get to work on these stickers and work some more on my illustrations that I need to get sent in for... Oh, what is it? June, July, August is what I'm trying to get done, plus the summer shop update. I have to get all this stuff submitted in time for it to arrive in time for the summer season and for my Patreon um, theme. I've got all the sketches done. All right, now I'm doing all the line art and next will be rendering with color and then I can design the sticker sheets and the washi tape and everything else. I've already got the pins done. I did that first because those take the longest. Um, but yeah, that's gonna be the rest of this week for me, Thursday, Friday, um, with the exception of the Patreon, my Patreon schedule, my Patreon posting schedule, um, and then my Instagram posting schedule, which I have been terrible at this week. I've only posted once on Instagram this week. Instagram makes me sad because like no one is seeing my post anymore, but I'm trying to stick with it. Um, anyways, thank you so much for watching. If you made it this far, um, always remember that you are enough, and I'll see you next time. Bye.